Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about Amazon and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you change the country for your Amazon app? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you need to change the country for your Amazon app anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. Maybe you're a digital nomad and you're doing some traveling in a different country, but you need to order some items off Amazon, but you're not sure what would ship to your address. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in the Amazon app. It's this brown one with a black smiley face. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well. But I'm going to go ahead and open up my Amazon app now. Okay, guys, I went ahead and opened my Amazon app. This is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to change the country for your Amazon app, you actually have to do it in two different locations. The first is you're going to click on your profile icon down here on the bottom left. It looks like a little person icon. Okay, so once you do that, it's going to show you more information about your account. However, in order to change the country for your Amazon account, you need to click on this little flag here on the top right. Mine has the US flag and EN for English. Yours might say something different. It doesn't really matter. Just click on the flag. Okay. So here you can go ahead and change the country and region, language, and currency. So in order to change the country, you want to go ahead and click here on country and region. And here you can go ahead and choose the country that you would like to switch your Amazon account to. For example, I'll go ahead and click on Canada right here. All right. Once you do that, you're going to see the country right here. Now, if your country isn't listed there and you want to ship to that country, don't worry. We're going to go ahead and show you the next step in this shortly. Once you've changed the country here, go ahead and click on this yellow done button here at the bottom. Okay. So the page refreshes. Now I'm shopping in the Canada store for Amazon. Okay. So that's the first place you want to go ahead and change the address. Now, if you want to change the country to where your items are going to be shipped, what you're going to do is look for this button on your homepage. You can see mine says deliver to Australia. So it's only showing items that will ship to Australia, but let me go ahead and just click on this line. Okay. So next you're going to see this pop-up down here. It's going to show all the different addresses that you have associated associated with your Amazon account. But if you want to go ahead and change the shipping country to your Amazon account, you want to click on this button here called ship outside the US. Okay. So here is where you get a longer list of countries that Amazon will ship to. So for example, let's go ahead and just choose this one right here. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and click on Canada. Okay. Just a quick second later, the page refreshes. Now it's only going to show me items that will ship to Canada. So for example, let's go ahead and click on this knife right here. Okay. So once we click on this knife, it lets me know it will do deliver to Canada. Also just note that if you are shipping to a different country, Amazon will let you know what the shipping and duties fees are. So for example, this knife costs $147, but in addition to that, they're letting me know it's going to cost an extra $31 and seven cents. And that includes shipping and import fees deposit to Canada. Also note that the shipping time, if you are going to be shipping to a different country will vary. So for example, I'm filming this on the first of September and it's letting me know the soonest it's going to arrive would be September 18th. So about 17 days later. So that is really important that you pay attention to that, especially if you are used to one day or two day shipping with Amazon in the US. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to change the country for your Amazon account in the app, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.